and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Peachy and this channel is all about my Sylvanian Families collection. For today's video we're going to be unboxing this set here which is the Sylvanian Clinic Pharmacist. If you remember, at the very end of 2022 I made a video around my Sylvanian Families wish list. So it was 10 items that I had on my wish list that were either quite hard to find, retired, Japanese exclusive and no longer produced and a variation of this set was on that list. So the set that I put on that list and I'll pop a picture of it here was the 2003 Japanese exclusive uh, pharmacy set and it came with essentially the accessories that you can see here. So the baskets, the tables and the little pestle and mortar and scales and such. And I really like those accessories. I really wanted to put them into my village store to kind of bulk out that, that um, shop a little bit. And then I found out that they made this version. So I, at the time of making that video, I didn't realize this version existed, but this version is from 2013. And it comes with this really adorable pharmacist who is a bright field goat. And all the rest of the accessories are exactly the same. The only addition is this figure and there might be some slightly different colours on the accessories and bottles and things. I'm not 100% sure, but essentially it's the same set with an added figurine. And I really loved her purple kind of uniform. You know me, I love any Sylvanian that has a little uniform on because I think they're really cute. As soon as I knew this version existed, I knew I wanted to get this version instead of the version without the figurine. And I managed to find one and this was brand new. I've, I have opened it up to just check everything was there and everything. But yes, brand new unused set for a really reasonable price. So I was really happy to be able to add this one to my collection. So if we take a look at the box, you can see the front here. This is the newest kind of, I think it's called the Sylvanian Clinic or the Cottage Clinic or something like that. The, the newest hospital building, which essentially has the rounded sides. And you can see that they've set up the pharmacy set in there. Of course, we have to have some chocolate rabbits on the packaging. And then I'm hoping this might say uh, the name of the goat. I haven't put it through Google Translate yet though. I know she's a bright field goat, but I'm not sure of her first name and I'm hoping I'm gonna do some Google Translate on this box and hopefully it will be on there somewhere. And then on this side, you've got the promo image of everything that comes in this particular set. Again, on the background of that clinic building. On the back, you can see it. There we go, it's called the Country Clinic. So you can see the set inside the Country Clinic and you can also see on this side is the doctor's set. And then here's the detailed breakdown of everything that comes in the set. If you want to have a look at that, you could pause the video here and take a look at that. Got your usual warnings and disclaimers and such. And then on this side is the same image as the other side. And then nothing on the bottom, nothing on the top. So the interesting thing about this one is it was obviously marketed to go with that country clinic. So in the UK, I'm not sure about everywhere else, but in the UK we got a doctor's set, a nurse's set and a dentist set all marketed to go with that country clinic, but they never released this pharmacist set, which is interesting because we they had all the other ones in Japan, obviously. I just wonder why this one never made the translation to get um, a UK release or a worldwide release. So what I'll do now is I'll get the box open and show you all of the contents. So first up is the little pharmacist figure. Oops, you're gonna focus. And she's wearing this cute all-in-one uh, kind of dress in lovely lilac colour. She's got her little tail poking out the back there. And she's got the um, epoch flat hands. That's the, the figure the set comes with. It also came with one of my favourite things, which is a Japanese little catalogue. And I like how on the Japanese ones it tells you the year, so it tells you that this catalogue is from 2013. And on here you can see all the families, like you've got the Woodbrook Beavers there, the Neptune Sea Otters. All the different families, grunt pigs, and then you've got the kind of adventure seaside and adventure sets up there, some cars, some shops, so you've got the newer village store there, hamburger restaurant. Interestingly their ice cream van is blue, however in this country this was the fish and chips van and the ice cream van was white. 
if it's going to focus on it. So yeah, this one here, you can see that that's the ice cream van but in the blue colour. Donut shop cake stand and the vintage dress shop as well, just there. Then here's the country clinic stuff. So see, here's the nurse set and the dentist set which we'll probably be quite familiar with because those did get a worldwide release and obviously the, the clinic set did as well. And then nursery sets just up here. Baby Choo Choo train there. I do love that one, it's very cute. And then on the back, a big array of furniture. Lots of different furnitures. Most of these look familiar, so I think most of these got a worldwide release. Lots and lots of baby furniture as well. I also really like these little washing and housekeeping sets down the bottom here. Bathrooms there, and then the buildings themselves. Quite a few different buildings. You've got like Maple Manor there with the carport and the, the green roof house on the hill. And then I think these ones here in the orangey box, I think they might be uh, like costumes or uniforms. So like the clothes separate that you could buy. And some room sets there, carry cases, the at home sets with the chocolate rabbit figures. And also some Misty Forest, I think it's called Misty Forest up here with the little um, fairies. So they're very cute and a bit different and I don't think these ever got a worldwide release. But yes, I always like to have a little look at the Japanese catalogues. So now onto the accessories this set comes with. So first up there's two desk items. So the first one is this little reception desk and you can see it's got this nice glass piece with reception on it. It's got a little window here for you to be able to pass things through it's in this lovely pale blue colour so that's the first desk and then you also get a second desk to go alongside it and it's pretty much the same makeup without the glass and with this nice white top and then I've kept all the small accessories in the little plastic they came in but I have put the stickers on but some of them have kind of turned around so the stickers are on the back but essentially you get Little weighing scales, some little health drinks, like uh, shampoos, soaps, some more kind of body lotion type things. These are some more vitamin drinks. There's the pestle and the mortar, or pestle and mortar there. Uh, these are hand creams and toothpastes. So lots of little kind of health and beauty kind of accessories. Then you also get this little stand to put the drinks on and it's got the same kind of lettering and coloration as the glass reception desk and then there's some cardboard and paper accessories and I've popped those in these little baskets so you get three of these little wicker baskets and they're all the same shape and size you also get this little box or stacked box of tissues and this is one of the boxes that I had to fold myself. This is a bit of a thinner card, so it's more papery than card than what we'd be used to. So I was a little bit surprised to find it quite so thin. And then also some little paper accessories. So we've got a little packet of plasters, a little kind of prescription uh, case uh, prescription slip and the envelope that it would go in so these are nicely detailed and it's hard to show you on camera but in in real life they're, they're really easy to to read what's on them so they're nicely detailed but again they're more papery than card so I'd kind of expect these to be papery but usually for the boxes they use either a card or a slightly thicker paper stock so that's all the accessories it comes with what I'm going to do now is just set up kind of how it is on the box and we can take a look at how that looks. So here's everything out of the box and you can see it all fits onto the kind of display stand and baskets that are supplied really nicely. So you can see everything without it being too crowded together. So I really like that when they think about kind of how it's, it's going to look when you're um, displaying it or playing with it. 
I think the accessories in this set are quite unique so I'm happy to have them. I think the little goat pharmacist is really cute and I just popped Mrs um, Robinson the Red Panda here and she's coming to pick up a prescription. Overall I'm really happy with this set, I like that it comes with the additional figure but I think even the set without the figure is still really nice to have. I think it's going to look perfect in my village store and I'll be doing an updated video on the village store, there's a few more bits and bobs I want to get for that um, to kind of redo a setting up video of it with the additional accessories that I want to put in there. So look out for that coming soon or well as soon as I can gather together the rest of the accessories that I want to use to put in there. But that's all for today's video, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you again next time, bye bye for now!